The Hive just revealed their upcoming game mode by tweeting this out on Twitter. That's right, a Cloud Sword Toolbox and a coming soon emoji. And now, while you may have suspected that this either means duels are coming, Sky Royale is leaving, or even that Toolbox is going to be allowed in Sky Wars, we actually know what this means. And in this video, I'm going to be telling you everything that you need to know about Sky Wars kits. Kits are going to be coming to Sky Wars, but before you make up your mind on if this is a good or bad update, I'm going to just tell you right now that Clankstar, the owner of the Hive, has already announced that this is only going to be an LTM or a limited time game mode, and it will not be affecting the main Sky Wars game. Now, we've all seen limited time game modes like Block Drop disappear in months, while other modes like Sky Royale just stick around. I mean, seriously, when's that gonna go away? So we don't really know how long Sky Wars kits are going to be around, and for all we know, they could be gone in a month. Now, before I move on to the actually cool stuff, for those of you who don't know what Sky Wars kits are, think of like Galaxite perks or Sky Wars kits in Cubecraft, if you played either of those. They're basically a free in-game adventure and they may take a little bit of time to unlock, but for a brief example of what they could look like, think about starting a game with 32 blocks of andesite, or I mean full chain armor, or just simple things like that. Now onto the weird stuff relating to this update, here's a timeline of everything relating to the update that I found a bit interesting. So Potato Pie released a video talking about Skywars kits on August 9th. Now, the Sonic update released on July 12th, introducing the coming soon NPC, and according to Clankstar, they only started planning this update mere weeks before the Potato Pie video dropped. Now, this most likely means that the Hive either put the coming soon NPC out with no actual plans for it, or they had some sort of issue causing them to create a completely different update. Now, unless they actually put the NPC out with no plans, I wouldn't be surprised if we see some other big update before the end of 2021. Comment below your thoughts on kits, but anyway, that's all.